What's good, YouTube? Welcome to the Daily Original. Uh, today I have for you a, uh, well not today, obviously today I'm going to have a bunch of videos, but today, I said it again, right now I'm uh, showing off Seatown, uh, Kill Confirmed Seatown. Uh, it's one of the new, let me lower the volume here so I can hear myself speak. It's one of the new game modes in Modern Warfare 3. Start off here examining this nice column architecture right there and then woo let's get straight to work uh, game type is uh, one of the new game types like I said previously uh, you pretty much kill someone they drop dock tags pick up the gold dock tags uh, and that gives you a point uh, as you can see we're losing right now 0 and 1 so that means someone killed someone uh, or the op opposing team killed uh, one of our guys and picked up the dock tags and scored some points uh, in order to stop them from doing that, we could pick up uh, uh, the dog tags that our guys dropped that would be uh, denying the kill. Also, we could just not die. Uh, so, uh, so that's what's up. Uh, the map is Sea Town. Sea Town's, uh, you know, it's kind of like I believe it was. Uh, it was a Modern Warfare 2. I think it was Modern Warfare, the first one. Um, it's kind of like Market. You guys remember Market? It's something like that. It's got a in in the way that uh, it's got a market in the middle, pretty much, and then all around it, it's got like a ton of shit going on. Uh, so they have buildings. Let's see here, they've got it's two-story buildings. I don't think there were any two-story buildings in the market. I honestly can't can't recall that far back. Uh, Cause it was like what four, three years ago. Jeez, time flies when you're playing Call of Duty. Uh, but yeah. This map, it's will fail right here. I know it's a fail. Yep, fail. This map, I, I kind of at first I didn't like this map, but then it grew on me. Like you, you find out all the spots. Like right now they're in that top over there. You see that, saw that balcony. Like to my left on the top, there's a nice little spot up there that you could they have uh that you could look down over to that to that alleyway that I just got out of. Um, but yeah, it's a bunch of tight corners as you can see, uh, which I love about that. I wanna. I wanted to throw a flash, and I dropped down my uh, my radar thingy. What is that thing called? Whatever. I need to change that. And here I forget to pick up the uh, the tag, so I didn't. I didn't get my team a point for that. And now I picked that up. 14-14 tied the game. What? What? Ah, and then we lose. Oh nope. Always tying the game. I got my UAV now. Cool thing is now is. Uh, as I said in the previous video, over to the uh, the kill streaks on the left hand side or right hand side. Whenever, like I got predator missile, I think I got a uh, AC-130 as well. Whenever you get, uh, actually I think I'm going support package right now, support class, support kill streak or whatever. Bad right there. Wow, bad stuff. Uh, you could actually flip up and down for which one you want to use. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm using the CM901 right now. It's one of the better early guns. Uh, I think it's like the fourth gun you unlock. It's pretty decent. It's it's a hell of a lot better than using the M4A1. Um, but when you do start off, I would definitely use, uh, if you want a fully automatic gun, then go for the M4 with the assault class, or even the M16. The M16 does a lot more damage, even though it's three-shot burst. Right here, I'm picking up a P90 because I want to try it out because it's like the next gun that I'm going to lock. And I do some mad work with it. Well, I only get one kill right here, but later on, uh, I don't know if it's in this video. It's the kill you kill people so so quickly. It's ridiculous. Like right here, I think I'm gonna die because I rush into things. Yep, running gets you killed. Do not run. I cannot stress that enough. Running is. I, they should have never even put running in the game. Uh, it's just it's just the means of getting killed. Uh, so yeah, I got. Uh, I think I'm running because uh, they've got these new things called uh, proficiencies. So it's pretty much gun based. You don't. It's like uh, reduced kick. You could get range on it. So what range would do is you could pick out uh, enemies from. Uh, you'd like see see how far away that guy was. If he came a little bit closer, he would have had that little red tag above his name that says his name. But if I had the proficiency range on my gun, I'd be able to see, like right now, I'd be able to see his uh, his name shout, uh, his name pop up over his head. And that would like help me track him. Uh, so that's one of the proficiencies. Another proficiency is uh, an attachment, uh, focus, melee. These are uh, proficiencies for the 
for these. See, there's that, there's that, there's that spot that I was talking about. So he's got, uh, he's got a lookout for this whole area right here, and he's just doing work. But yeah, those are the proficiencies for uh, the submachine guns. Uh, different, like assault class. Uh, well, not assault class. Like your assault rifles, your sniper rifles. They all have different proficiencies. So it's pretty much uh, down to that. Narrow down. Do that. Let's see here. What else can I say? What you, why would I run towards the grenade? Horrible. That's another thing. Uh, the guys, like, I got the game early. So, uh, everyone that's online right now is ridiculously good. Because you, you had to go through a lot of stuff to get the game early. And that pretty much means you're, like, a diehard Call of Duty fan. I mean, you either paid a lot of money for I don't know. I could have killed that guy earlier. I just suck. Well, what was I saying? Well, yeah, you're pretty much a die-hard Call of Duty fan, and you're willing to spend a lot of money on the game. So you're you're probably going to be amazing at the game. Uh, so that was that was a problem I was having. I was playing against a lot of great players, uh, and my KD just at first. Uh, well, the first two games, my KD was about like a one point something, uh, which is which is bad because I'm used to like having a four or five. Uh, but then as I kept playing. Like right now, I think I'm level 40, I believe. <laughs> My KD is... You don't even want to know. Knife him! Jeez, I had to call him my strike and then... Or I had to call him my UAV and then... Knife him. Got some lag. Um, but yeah, right now my KD is... Not even worth talking about. It's embarrassing. They're going to have to create a whole new account. Uh, what else can I say? Oh, I am kind of angry. Because... Uh, I played. Uh, I had three games uh, saved up on my uh, on my computer. I had games with uh, Tmart. I had games with. Uh, I had two games with Tmart actually, and then I also had a game with. Uh, oh, what was his name? Bum bum bum. I'm scrub. Come on, seriously, right now? Justra, I'm stupid. Justra. And Justro was playing, he was on his second prestige, so I had loads of fun playing with them. And I had, like I said, I had three, three or two games saved up. And then today, when I, I'm, I finally sat down to start editing everything and doing voiceover, and I couldn't find them. I think they completely got deleted off ITV, and I was so angry. So I was like, no, but whatever. Uh, whatever, I could just, I mean, yeah, sad face. That was some good gameplay. Uh, we had some fun time, but uh, I was actually doing a little bit better than them in one of the games. And I was kind of excited. I was like, yes, better than Tmar. So cool. And Justo was already second prestige. So he, I think, got second to bottom, and I went first. I was like, no way. This is not happening. This is not happening right now. But yeah, unfortunately, that stuff got deleted. So mad. But whatever. I'll hop on today later. Uh, probably get some more uh, gameplay in hopefully land in a party with them again they're always playing they're always getting new stuff for uh, for their YouTube channel so hopefully we'll meet up and there isn't really a lot of players uh, well I got the week uh, I sorry I got the game like a week ago there was about 500 600 people on and then uh, and now I think I honestly don't know what the actual numbers are but I would say it's in the in the 5,000 range so it's not going to be that big of a struggle to to get in a, a party with them. All right, show's over. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, stay tuned for the next one.